surrounds a pasture after several cows were shot in the middle of the night. This happened July 19th on a Charlotte County farm a few miles east of State Road 31, and police believe the shooters shot from the road. Wink News reporter Jolena Esperto live in Charlotte County now. Jolena, you talked to the owner of those cows. What did she say? The owner told me she's not sure why anyone would want to shoot this adorable herd of cows here, but she also told me she's willing to pay big money to find the person or the people who did so. These cows, all 32 of them, are like kids to Kim and Joe Lewis. The couple moved to Charlotte County from Indiana when they retired to raise cows as pets. Our cows are worth it because like I said, they're family to us. So they took personally when someone or some group of people started shooting their cows, killing five of them. They are offering $10,000 for each arrest and conviction of each person responsible. Oh, actually, we retired here and all we want to do is let our cows graze the fields and be happy. We're, we don't we don't kill our cows. They're your pets? Yes. Um, as you could see, they eat right out of your hand. Yeah, they're like dogs. <laughs> Normally all of them will, but they're kind of scared. Spooked, Kim Lewis told me, ever since the morning of July 19th, when she heard the shots and grabbed her rifle to investigate. And I noticed them running, going in circles. Some were falling down. Um, some were obviously injured. And I couldn't shoot because I had the gun, but the cows were between me and the shooter. So she didn't fire because she feared the shooter or shooters would keep killing her cows instead of running away. 12 cows are healing from gunshots, but according to the vets, they are still at risk of lead poisoning. One cow can no longer move very easily and may have to be put down. And so far, there are no suspects in the shooting. Since that early morning attack, Kim keeps the cows close to her house now, and she wants people to know that the people or just the person responsible for killing the cows, they were on an ATV or buggy while they did so. Live in Charlotte County, Jolena Spurdo, Wink News.